Oh, thank you, Lindsay. Okay, now, the lady sitting in the elevator, y'all, was pissed, okay? She was pissed having to smell foodie because she rubbed her nose. Anybody who comes in contact with this girl knows that she stank because they have, you see them rub with their nose, right? We'll call the police. That courthouse is nice. We are today in the court and uh, we are waiting. Mabrook, Mabrook, Salah and Chantal. Mabrook, inshallah, Mabrook. Mabrook, Mabrook, Mabrook. Hello, guys. We just finished from the marriage contract and we are going home to celebrate. Yalla. Wedding party. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, guys. So I just decided to put together a few snaps of our. She looks like trash right now. This angle. Okay, he's only doing this angle for her because this is the angle that she wants him to do. Everybody knows this is the fat girl freaking angle. This is my angle. This is the angle I use. It makes me look slimmer, okay? I don't use as much now, but I used to use angle 24-7, okay? This is how I fat fish niggas back in the day. <laughs> we we not even going to front like we did fat fish niggas back in the day. We did, okay? <laughs> That's how we can call it. But this is that angle. That ring has been on that finger for a long time. Right, Pippi Long Stockings. <laughs> for courthouse, wedding bees. I know it doesn't look like much to some, but for us, it meant everything. It was very special because I was, well, for me at least, I was marrying my soulmate. And I know Salah feels the same way. And mashallah, mashallah, I am so happy. And I just want to share a little bit with you guys. We went to a courthouse. Hey, it was not a religious Lipping wedding. Carmel. It was just done. Hey, Carmel. We're more focused on the legal side of things, just being legally married. And we'll have a wedding at some point, uh, maybe in the future. What's the point of her, of her having a damn freaking wedding? She didn't scare away all this man's friends. He has no real friends no more. So who's going to come to this freaking wedding? Nobody but just her and Salah and God. Inshallah. And God probably won't so show up. For now, this is all we decided we're comfortable with showing you. Um, people will just have to keep speculating and accusing us of being fake married. That's fine with us. We have decided that we will not be showing any kind of personal marriage contract. Number one, that's not anyone's business. And number two, we just don't feel comfortable with that kind of personal information being circulated online. So. Right. Hold on. Okay. Hello, y'all. Correct me. Because I know marriage documents in different countries are different. The marriage documents here in the U.S. have your name, his name, signature, and two witnesses, right? One for him, one for you. Period, because I was a witness on my mom's marriage docu document when she got married, so I know what it looks like, okay? <laughs> what other information is included on a marriage document that she don't want to show that we already don't freaking know? We know her address, her name, everything. So what could she be hiding? <laughs> she took a piece of paper from a copier, okay, and put it in a, uh, in a little envelope like that. <laughs> a little package. <laughs> Just a fool us. That will be our personal... Um information and also i will not be sharing personal information like my status here in kuwait and things like that but what we will do is just share a few snaps like i said of our day so i will explain a bit of the process from my perspective um basically we had to go to this courthouse and there were a lot of stairs to go up to get in and the place was very busy and had many many floors the elevator Address area was chaotic okay. people were waiting a long time to get in an elevator and they were jam-packed okay so yes the address probably would show up on there but the address you can easily bleep that stuff out the the sensitive information you can bleep it all all we need to see is the marriage certificate with the seal her name and his name right or wrong that's it or it's you know what i'm saying that's all we need to see she can bleep all that shit out she's not dumb she's trying to play us like this we're is dumb though. one instance where i appreciate the gender segregation and the women the rings had their own elevators and like a lift attendant so <laughs> that was awesome which you'll see in the video as well in the video snaps and so then we went up to the floor where we had to wait to get to a courtroom uh we did just um it, it was a bit of a process you have to file for marriage and all this and that um and so oh, hey dot i know there's going to be some details left out person. but again these are just personal things and we appreciate our privacy being respected yeah so <laughs> um a lot of people just feel entitled to certain information and it's just no we we have the right to privacy so also um but there are some things i don't mind sharing with you guys so also we, we got into the court 
courtroom and we stood in front of two judges and they basically asked me, um, they wanted to make sure that I accepted the marriage with Salah and that he did pay me the, I think they call it mahr, if I'm pronouncing that right. It's something that um, Muslims in most Islamic countries do. The husband has to pay legally, um, give a gift, monetary gift to the wife and one during the marriage as well. So that's, um, I did, um, that's personal as well, but we agreed to, but it's. Okay. I want to know what the gift was. It's personal, right? I know what the gift is. Hippie, it's gotta be. What else? Why she? Why she wouldn't tell us what a gift was? Why? What is so personal about a damn gift that she's gonna keep it confidential? He gifted her the gift of sex. <laughs> uh, every marriage that happens here. So, uh, also, they asked me where my father was, which really was an odd question to me because it just really, but it, you know, it made me realize how important father figures are in the lives of women here. Um, so as parental figures, family, the family structure is very, very sacred here. So um, you don't have many single parents, if, I don't know, if any, unless, you know, even if women are widowed or whatever, or divorced, they usually seek another husband and vice versa. So um, usually the father is present to give the blessing for the marriage. Uh, so I had to explain that I don't talk to my father and they just kind of look at me sadly. <laughs> so um, Salah had to explain for me. Mm. He's so supportive in ways I can't even tell you guys. And yeah, so I am so happy. And that makes sense, Abby. This was uh, an experience for sure. Um, I don't know what else there is to say, really. I guess just that we had to wait for a bit in the courtroom. Outside of the courtroom is what you see some of the snaps of, and then inside the courtroom. And I know there's a lot of the way he's folding up that paper doesn't seem like it's important. You know what I'm saying? When you have a piece of documentation, it's like that you're gonna value. Like a marriage document to me is something that you value. Okay. Ain't like a birth certificate you want to fold up, put in your purse, and keep moving. No, that's a document that you want to preserve and hang on your wall. Most people hang up marriage certificates or something, right, in their home. I don't know. That's just weird to me how they just folded it up and just walk around with it like that. To me, it doesn't seem sentimental. It's it's not real. To, it can't be real. Well, it might be real, y'all. Who knows? And, um, the actual dates of marriage and the actual the contract the of marriage. But those are all things that most people don't right. show online whenever they get married. Uh, they usually just show the wedding ceremony. We didn't have one as of yet. Again, it was just very, um, very. It was a very quick courthouse wedding for now. But uh, inshallah, in the future, we will organize some kind of party. So it was just low key and uh, celebrated. We celebrated with friends after, friends and family afterwards in private. But um, that's basically all we did for the time being. And we will, if we do have some kind of celebration in the future uh, that we can make public, we will. But there's a lot in my life now that I'm keeping private. And marriage details, I think you can appreciate, especially with the amount of sleuth. Girl, she talking, she out of breath. Y'all hear that? We have online, um, very invasive. The internet can be very invasive. So we just really think it's in our best interest to keep a lot private. Oh, and, seven. But we did want to share a little bit of the day with you. Abby, so damn. No. It was a... Uh, <laughs> Very nice day, very special to marry my soulmate. And I couldn't be happier. I couldn't have asked for a more supportive husband in every single way. And I feel very, very blessed. And I'm just going to try to take advantage of being positive and appreciate these blessings that God has given. He's given me a wonderful man to take care of me. And uh, as husband and wife, this is, of course, my, my first marriage. And may it be the only one in my life, inshallah. And thank you guys so much for watching this. And we will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Masalama. You know, Abby, it's not even the fact that you had seven, girl. It's the fact. It's the fact that you keep pulling them. Okay, boo. Whatever you do, teach me your ways. <laughs> okay. Uh oh. So she posted an Instagram, and I want to take a look at her Instagram because she posted another. Uh, let's look at it before I even talk about. It. She posted another. Um. How do I search on this damn thing? Oh, search right here. I'm about to share with y'all. Give me a second. Let me pull her up. Because uh, I don't want y'all looking at what I be looking at my Instagram. <laughs> the shade. He's I'm honest. Okay. So y'all remember the game we played yesterday is it a filter or is it real life okay let's share screen microsoft edge instagram all right 
Is this a filter? Or she posted this picture five hours ago. Okay. She posted this picture five hours ago. Make sure you can see the whole picture though. Yo, I love this new touchscreen computer I got. It's I can zoom in with my hands. It is phenomenal. Look, if y'all are in the market for a computer, get you a touchscreen laptop. That's all, period. I'm here for it. Naughty chef. <laughs> I mean, I, I'm sure y'all people. I look, one of these days, I'll give y'all a little insight on my life and what I look at on Instagram and stuff, okay? <laughs> no, I will one day, y'all. Uh, but filter or uh <laughs> or real life <laughs> someone give that a mirror a real mirror <laughs> why would you lie to your audience into new prospective followers this makes you look untrustworthy there is nothing in real world with having to deal with ham and her scent from any length of time to a sane or sober person. <laughs> Angel of Glass says, a filter. Girl, I'm with you on that. Uh-oh. I don't get out of that. Get out of that. Mm -mm. There we go. That's better that way. Um, that's from Canada, right? No, I don't know. She, it, is it from Canada? She just posted like maybe six hours ago, something like that. Filtered to uh, filtered all the hell. <laughs> I thought it was recent. This must be Canada, um, Miss Abby. This must be Canada because, um, the fact that she don't have that purple headdress anymore. I've never seen that before. I have seen this hoodie either. Yeah, that's the bathroom. Yep, bathroom on the on the right. Y'all know her house layout. <laughs> I'm done with y'all. <laughs> she don't believe in peace, not at all. So they can wear a hoodie. Beanie. That's what she says. She says that instead of. Uh, a buyer, she can wear a hoodie. It's the same thing. But I don't know. Can we believe what she's saying? Yeah, those are filters before she left for Kuwait. When she was so why she just now posted it on Instagram. That's what I don't understand. That's a hoodie. That's a hoodie. Wait, no, oh, stop. Come on. That's the hoodie she's she and Amberlyn had. Amberlyn have the same hoodie? Hmm. They're sisters. Okay. I think she hasn't posted anything else new. Yeah, she hasn't posted anything else new since that. Oh, I didn't see this last time. Oh, she got a filter on there too. Oh, she got a filter on there. Yeah, that's a filter. Girl, cut up these filters. Never seen all those. Okay. Your love, your love.